Hey, it's some old guy coding again. And it's time for another geek box. This is, let's see, what is this? This is September of 2017. And this is the September's Geek Box. So if you haven't gotten yours yet, uh, you know, don't watch the video. So we're going to find out what's in here. Seems to be bulging with goodness, you see. It's just uh, a little extra something in there, it seems like. All right, let's open her up and see what we can find here. What kind of treasures do we have this month? Uh, ooh, right on top we got the paperwork. What the heck is that? Alright, it looks like we have some, uh, some extra stuff in here. So we'll take a look at that. So it's a uh, happy, happy Hobbit September is what we have today. So let's take a look and see what we got. We've got some Magic all-in-one 3D printing adhesive. Hmm, interesting. I saw that on our website. Looks like we've got some samples here for it. That's pretty cool. And then, what the heck is this? It's an empty uh, canister. And then we have filament. So let's see what the deal is for the canister. That is for the project this month, a sundial. Looks like the base of that. Very nice. What else do we have in here? Oh, we got some filament. Whoa! Oh, Raptor Series PLA in a bright yellow. Look at that. That's pretty nice. So Raptor PLA is great for, uh, you know, uh, things that need to go outdoors. It can handle that. It's a very nice product. Let's look down one more here. And what's the other color we have today? Ooh, Raptor Series Steel Blue. So we got two Raptor Series uh, PLAs today. And uh, that's pretty amazing. So two Raptor Series, those are, those are you know, more pricey than the, the regular uh, plastic. So that's, that's great. What a deal. Anything else in the box? Nothing in there. So that's interesting. We've got two Raptor PLAs here. We can do uh, some, some really strong stuff with that. Uh, uh, empty uh, bottle case for the bottom of the uh, project, this one. And we have some uh, magic adhesive samples. Look at that. Yeah. That would be interesting. Let's see what it says here. So it's the Digital Sundial Group Project. We'll have to go out and take a look at that one. Looks like a lot of fun. And a place for parts. Very nice. Thanks for watching.